This one actually comes in a set of two, which is nice. If you're trying to be vegan, vegetarian, or anything like that, jackfruit will. Here is the long awaiting cap. $99 each. I said, eh, Rudisha, I don't want to. <laughs> see, talking. It's been a minute. It's been a long time. It's been a hot minute. <laughs> Welcome back you guys to another vlog. It's Thursday today um, and I just woke up so I'm a little bit, you know, I had to pick up this camera or I'm just gonna forget to vlog. I have my lemon water here. I've been drinking this every single morning and throughout my day, honestly, I just fill up my cup and I'm good to go. I have some few things planned today, mainly content related stuff. I have some Ipsy content to get out of the way. I have an IG story to film for them. I have some packages that I need to ship today for the giveaway that I had a few weeks ago. And I have a picnic theme uh, Instagram reel that I want to film for Ipsy. So I'm excited for that. So I'm gonna go to the store, like Home Goods. Is it Home Goods, Trader Joe's, whatever, and pick up some few things for the picnic theme. Um, so I'm excited for that because Baby's gonna actually help me bring this theme to life the life of a creator it's gonna be funny because i'm just gonna do all of that just for a few second clip it's crazy but we're also gonna enjoy the little picnic too so here is the long awaiting couch y'all we have been waiting five months well it got delivered in may so before may we were waiting for at least five months five to four months but we love it it's super comfortable now you guys can see there's a difference with this one and this one because this one is actually foam, while this one is made out of feather. Now we ordered the one that has feather in it because it's just more comfortable, more cozier. The foam one is all right, but it's just more stiff. It's, it's foam. You can't really go wrong with that, but I love the look of foam. It just looks more cleaner. That's the one thing that we didn't like about the feather. You just have to fluff it out for it to look more fuller and alive after sitting on it, so that, that kind of gets annoying, but we just love it because it's just more cozier. So now they have to come back and replace this one. Um, mind you guys, they delivered on May and then they have to come back again and it's the end of June to deliver this one. So they're gonna replace that one and then we have one more piece. It should have been a six piece. One, two, three, four, five, and then six is gonna come. Another update in my lovely home is the new rug. <laughs> I got this from, I think, Ruggable. I'm gonna link it, but I think it goes really well with the new um, couch. And then I'm gonna also purchase a new coffee table. Now, this one is so different from the old rug that we used to have, such a different vibe. Because the old place, I was going for more of that black and white theme. This place, I actually wanna keep it very clean. Um, very minimalistic that's the look i'm trying to go for it's still a work in progress you guys i'm still creating like a whole mood board for this living room but so far this rug i'm very happy with it it is a long rug by the way it is so huge it goes all the way to there hi i'm tara lee cobble of the bible recap podcast and book and today you and i get to talk about the verse of the day matthew 7 8. this is jesus speaking and here's what he says for everyone who asks receives the one who seeks, finds. And to the one who knocks, the door will be open. But, but desiring more of what? More of just anything? More power? More money? Those things aren't inherently bad to want. But scripture seems to point us to wanting even better things than that. But regardless of what we want, Jesus says that we should bring that desire to God. To ask him. He promises to listen. He promises to respond. And he sent out his army to destroy the murderers and burn their town. And he said to his servants... The wedding feast is ready and the guests I invited aren't worthy of the honor. Now go out to the street corners and invite everyone you see. So the servants brought in everyone they could find, good and bad alike. <laughs>
taking a break. I gotta eat something. And then also, my freaking internet is acting up. So that's kind of annoying because I have to submit some content and my internet is not working, so. But I'm hungry, I'm gonna make something to eat. I think I might do tacos. Um, by the way, y'all, I've been doing the no meats challenge for a whole month, so I'm gonna just eat some tacos. I have been loving, I'll probably share with this recipe on another vlog, but the way I make my tacos, I use jackfruit. If you're trying to be vegan, vegetarian, or anything like that, jackfruit, will just give you that meat texture. I usually get the one in the can. You can get the whole big one, but the one in the can will do for now because I just don't know where to get the bigger one and that's just too much work. I'm still learning about stuff like this. So I made this yesterday. Let me warm it up so you guys can see. But um, yeah, you can use jackfruit um, for chicken salad. You can use it. I've seen a lot of recipes. Tacos, like I mentioned, nachos, soups, chili. This stuff is good. I mentioned this on my Instagram story and I said that one day in the future, my goal in life would be to go plant-based, like pure plant-based. But for now, I'm gonna just be doing like the one meat, the one meat, the, the uh, no meat challenge for a month and probably work like that, like start from there. I know I could go vegetarian, like with no doubt. Vegan is definitely more tougher because vegan includes no cheese and no eggs. I love eggs. Girl, I eat eggs a lot. Like a lot. In a week, I could eat eggs like probably every day for breakfast, boiled eggs. So yeah, that's why I'm like vegan is tough. But I've been enjoying it. My energy has been pretty freaking amazing. Um, yeah, it's, it's, I don't know, I love doing this. I love it, I love it. <laughs> Smells really good, but it looks like this. You have to open it up for it to be a little loose. It looks like, the, oh my gosh, ain't that crazy? Do y'all see this right now? This is why I've been loving this and it's super delicious. I will link uh, just a random recipe from Pinterest. Now, I don't follow the recipe to the T, I just season it however I want it, but I'm still gonna link the recipe for you guys. And then I'm also going to have a side of fruit. I am going to put some salsa on there. I think this is the salsa that I'm going to use. I don't like spicy food, but this is pretty spicy, but I just put a little bit just for flavor and it tastes really, really good. Oh, another one that I have. Um, okay, so this is another one that I have that is pretty good, still spicy, but really really good on your tacos this makeup right here is all going to the winners of this giveaway that i did um this one is actually going to go to a lovely girl in kenya these ones i can't remember their address but it is all international so i need to get this shipped out today before i forget and i don't want to forget okay we got to get things done Can I please get a venti iced um, matcha latte with two pumps of classic syrup, please? A venti iced matcha tea latte with two pumps of the classic? Yes, ma'am. All right, anything else for you? Nope, that should be it. All right, it's gonna be 11. Ugh. No, it's not. Wait, <laughs> sorry, my computer is no, so <laughs> weird today. No, you're good, you're good. All right. 572. That's awesome. Yeah, thing. that makes sense. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, no, you're good. Like, you're good. Yeah, I love that, like, super minimalistic. Yes. Like, yep. Love Me it. too. It's like the new trend. Yeah. Yeah, very so simple. Good. Yes. No straw. No okay. straw. <laughs> you're good. Have Thank you so it. much. You too. Mm. Okay. First of all, I'm hot. Second of all, I just got done doing this stuff right now and it is 4 p.m. <laughs> when I tell you, I had to confirm all the addresses. One of the ladies' address was not accurate so I had to you know, contact her through Instagram and then we have different times so she couldn't get back to me on time. It was a lot, but 
I'm done. So we're gonna head to, um, am I gonna do TJ Maxx first or, yeah, let's do, which way is TJ Maxx? This way. Yeah, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna head to, not TJ Maxx, I keep saying TJ Maxx, Home Goods, girl, Home Goods, so I can get some blankets and some baskets, or at least one basket for the picnic. And then um, I should be good for this picnic and then we're gonna go to the grocery store. Trader Joe's and that's literally on the way back home. So let's go to Home Goods first and get that out the way. Y'all, I just got here. The way I'm about to be in and out of this place is gonna be hilarious. I think I'm gonna grab one of these. This one actually comes in the set of two, which is nice. I'll probably place some like blueberries, strawberries on this. I don't know yet, but these are what I was coming here for. So I'm going to go ahead and see what they have in the sweets area. Girl, hold on. Wait a minute. This is nice. Oh my gosh. And this is nice too, but this one is better. Let's see how much it is. $5.80, not bad. That's nice because you cannot have a picnic without snacks. I don't know what I'm gonna grab, but so far I got cookies. I need two of these. It is so hot, and the little wind that's actually blowing is unnecessary. Oh my gosh, you may ask, why do you have this on, Esther? Just, you know, take it off. I don't want to. I don't want to. There's a reason why I'm rocking it. By um, update, I put the, the throw-on blank blankets away because, girl, they were $99. I was wondering, man, these are nice. And there was no tag on it until she was like, oh, these are $99 each. I said, eh, Rudisha, I don't want <laughs> See, Doc, it's, I'll find something in my house because it's just a quick picture. I might do like a huge blanket, white blanket. No, I don't know. That's why I wanted to do throw on blanket because I wanted it just a quick picture, like nothing to, um, I didn't want to go through my closet to put my blanket on the grass, but if I have to, then I have to. But next stop is Trader Joe's and Trader Joe's is actually right here. I have one next to my place, but this one is literally across from home goods so we're gonna do that it's five let's try to get home this um content that i'll be filming is a super quick one so i will probably do like one hour makeup baby's actually gonna be home by then so he's gonna help me um prep some sandwiches and stuff like that it's just all about the image like i have this idea hopefully it comes together really nicely so let's head to um Trader Joe's. Wow, I feel like I am the worst vlogger today. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm back home, you guys. I feel like I am the worst vlogger. I went to Trader Joe's and then I also stopped at Whole Foods because Trader Joe's does not have collard greens for some odd reason. They only have their greens pack, so they still didn't have uh, collard greens at all. So I had to stop at Whole Foods and grab that and I actually grabbed just a few more things that I didn't, didn't get at Trader Joe's but here's a mini haul. I'm not really going to go into detail because girl my time is really small right now. Girl today, today has been such a long day. I did not plan for the shipping part to take that long at all. But anyways, um, so I'm going to go ahead and change and film the video and just do my hair and stuff like that and then we'll go from there. <laughs>
today has been a pretty good day. <laughs> We're finally here doing a little picnic slash finishing up this content. Um, babe is actually back in the house to change into something more presentable. He didn't like the outfit he had on, so he's like, uh-uh, I gotta change. If you look like that, I gotta get myself together, which is fine. Um, sunset is happening here pretty soon. Oh, there he is. Well, oh, babe actually did. <laughs> oh, we, we have the same color. Grab that one, because it's falling. This one? Yeah. Uh, I am got it. Oh, we got the treats. Okay, I gotta put this down. Anyways, you guys, I love the background. Hopefully, this picture turns out good. I'm gonna um, post it on here <laughs> once I upload this vlog. Obviously, it's gonna pop up here if it turned out really nicely because I, you guys, this picture has to be good because the vision I had in my mind. Ah, uh, let's just hope. I'm trying to think how to also incorporate my ipsy glam bag in this shot we're gonna see how it's gonna look we're gonna we're gonna play around with it but we got the food here this is how the setup is looking oh what a cute little setup i love it it's not too much but it's perfect enough since this is what i thought of this morning we have that little basket over there <laughs> with the bread we're gonna try to bring that up a little bit closer so then it's in the shot. We have some throw on pillows back here because we don't want this picture to look really boring. It is 9.20. It is so dark out. <laughs> Cheers, babe. Sorry, you guys. My camera went dead, but that is it for today. We're just going to sit out here, talk, and chill for the night. Just going to watch the cars go by, too. Yeah, it's very feel like it's wet. It's yeah, it does feel wet. Anyways, one thing about me, I don't even like olives. But for the sake of this picture, we had to get some olives, okay? I'm gonna just go ahead and snack on those fruits right there and yeah, so we can go inside and eat dinner, but yes, done for the night, thank God. Ooh. 